Okay, to those of us that live in Macau, you've probably seen this Phoenix tree building from afar, from over on that side. I always see it too. And my plan is to walk down this road, and what's kind of interesting already is that um, it looks like they have all these barriers right here, so I don't know if I can even get over there. But we're going to try to walk down as far as we can and see what we can see while we have lighting and while I have battery left. That's the uh, border to Macau. There's a bridge way down there. You can kind of see it. There's nobody around. It's really weird. Um, but yeah, that's the bridge to Macau right over there. And um, yeah, anyways, that's Galaxy Casino over there. And the Kotai Strip is right over on the other side of the water. I wanted to get to that water. I'll, I'll try to see if I can get to it. But as of now, we're right here by the Phoenix Tree Building and we're gonna walk down that way. Hey, check it out Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Okay, so let's walk. So we're in this financial district. A lot of it is still under cranes and underutilized. That's the one we can see everywhere in Macau. So I've kind of been wanting to see that for quite a while um, up close just to see what's around here. And I, I got to give you some full disclosure of looks more like that looks like a little bit like construction stuff, like temporary construction stuff. Um, looks that way to me. So maybe later they'll fully open up that waterfront and they're just kind of keeping it as it is for the moment. But it looks like kind of high security, right? Because I don't think they want people um, swimming back and forth to Macau or whatever. So they'll probably. Um, but anyways, this is I always see this in Macau. And this is what it looks like up close. And it looks like nobody's in here yet. There's a bus station right here. I wonder if there's even any buses that go here. I don't know. This is where we're at. I guess there's a 62 bus that comes through here. So, um, too high bus. Somebody on a bike doing probably what I'm doing to like Let's see what's going on in here. So yeah, that looks like... Yeah, I can't get over that waterfront side. Anyways, we're still going to film down here because a lot of people, if you're anything like me, you want to see what Hingachin looks like. This is the whole financial district right in here. Still lots of it is still being constructed as well. But in the future, this will be pretty huge. So in the future, this will be... Um, yeah, Phoenix Tree Building it says right there. There's security right there. So in the future, this whole area will be um, um, like a big financial center for between China, the Portuguese-speaking countries, Spanish-speaking countries. Basically, they say the Latin world and, and, and China. So it's kind of a way to integrate the UN. So there's some of our roads right there. Um, so yeah, kind of a cool building. Phoenix Tree Building. Way down there is the... Um, way to Macau that's all galaxy all those cranes over there and that's all galaxy everything from there to there is galaxy casino so um it's interesting to see it from this side and when that waterfront is open it'll be kind of amazing to um be able to walk along it and see the Macau side from here I was really hoping to see that today uh, I, I think you know because this is an international border I think they don't really want people walking there because somebody could, you know, maybe they hang around there and they jump across, whatever. Some immigration issues, maybe. Huh, it's so quiet in here. So yeah, I was kind of speculating why it was so quiet. And I think it's one, because it's not fully developed yet. So it's kind of still under construction. You can see cranes everywhere. I don't think there's people living in these. It doesn't seem to be anyways. I think also because it's not integrated with Macau yet, as they're planned to have it be. So maybe later that will open up more and they'll integrate it more maybe. So those are probably probably the biggest reason. And number two, I think if it's, um, I think I mentioned in my last video, um, this is Hengqin number seven video, I think it's number seven on, um, on this April 9 of 2023. I've uh, filmed nine and um, but I think so number two, I think, is that, you know, the finance, so back in video number um, eight, seven, uh, I'll label them. Um, but anyways, back in the other, um, 
I'm gonna have to find some way to creatively label it. But anyways, I wonder if I get to the waterfront over there. But I think, you know, financial districts in general, like I used to live in New York, and it was actually kind of quiet in Shanghai, I visited like Pudong, and that was equally kind of quiet. So here's where we are right here. If I can get to the, get to the waterfront, I'm, maybe there's a way over here. I'm a little bit reluctant. There's like a lot of construction houses over here. And I think back there, they also look like a lot of construction houses too. But I see somebody on a bike over there. So, okay, so we basically just walked here. I'm gonna turn the camera off and try to get over there. And we'll just see what we can see. So let me jump over there and see. So we started down that way. We basically just did that block. There's the Phoenix. Um, and then we have more financial stuff here. And then what I'm gonna try to do is go over there because I see somebody walking down the waterfront. I don't know if they're legally walking down it or not. Um, it just looks like they don't want anybody in those waterfront areas. But it does look like there's a way over there. So we're gonna see if we can get over there or not. And I guess the only way is to go across so we're going to go check it all out. Like a little warning sign down there. It's like just going around. I saw a big sign that said like um, no trespassing. So it looks like you can't go over that. So I guess this is supposed to be kind of keeping people in. Um, then we see some of these buildings as well. So those are all that kind of financial stuff. There's a guy that's kind of watching that border. was really watching me a lot. And I wasn't sure if he's like a security guy or if he was like planning to jump it and swim over there or something. But those are all the Kotai Strip. And uh, yeah, right here, border alert area. So, And I guess what we're gonna do, I'm just gonna turn the camera off for a while because I'm not really so sure about this whole area. There's so many cameras and anyways, let's just turn this off. Kind of getting later, but we just basically came there, Galaxy Casino. You can still see more of this, lots of cranes everywhere. I see that building from quite a distance as well. Um, I think I see, a few of these and now we're still having those lights the security area there's a ship coming through right there then um, yeah that's all type of grande pequeño small mountain small type of mountain Kotai strip um central type of and over here we can see Macau Tower and we can also see Grand Lisboa Casino so it's kind of cool and it looks like there's security up here so I think we'll have to like end it over here but anyways, um, so that might be our ending because I think that's immigration. So, kind of cool. Nice waterfront. And we have all that, all that stuff too. So there's a border that's going by as well. And Macau Tower. So we'll end it there. Okay, so we're walking out of that district. Um, there's a bunch, I guess it's a border gate, so I don't want to film it too much. I mean, I think that's a park, so I'm not actually in a bad spot, but it feels weird. I guess they have security on both sides, so it's not much different, but but still, anyways, I'm just gonna... I think we got to see the Macau side from from that point of view. And I'm just gonna walk back on out, and, um, and we're in this little financial district, and we're just gonna meander our way to the main road. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do. I guess I'm gonna go back to Macau. I still have a little bit of battery. I could either go to... This will probably be the last one, most likely. If there's not, there'll be a nice surprise for you. Kind of cool. Okay. Okay, so earlier I was, I was at the ICC and I was walking down this street right here with all this traffic everywhere. So what's kind of interesting is um, I'm still in that street, but I kind of went inland to the water. And so I did two other videos in that space. And, um, but I just kind of wanted to give you a little bit more context because now I can see some more tall, bright tall buildings, some ones over there too. And then um, so and there's a little waterfront right here, kind of a business district. So this is just um, extending further from ICC. So it looks like this street is kind of interesting. There's some beautiful trees as well. It's like really, really interesting. So yeah, it's quite a bit later. Thought I'd tack it on to that last video though. And um, just put a little bit more interest to it. It's like crazy. It's like everything is so freaking new. So cool. So yeah, there's ICC and then the um, gate to uh, 
the cows will be that way. So that's the ICC down that way, and just we're just gonna um, kind of capture because I saw some of this on some of the signs right here, but there's some kind of cool imagery in these some of these uh, wall, some of this. So there's like a lion. So um, yeah. But anyways, um, here's a bus stop, so we're probably gonna end it here. But there's also like this kind of park stuff, and then all this financial stuff. So you can see all these buildings everywhere. They're all kind of lit up the skyline of Hengqin. And they go all the way down like that as well. And that's the ICC and then the border gate. It's kind of down that way a little bit. So I'm gonna be trying to get on a bus and just kind of see where I can go. Um, kind of want to get over to um, Dongbei, which is way, way on the other side of uh, Zhuhai. Okay. Anyways. It's like, so I can see all these skyline, all, this, all these buildings skyline right here. It's just kind of so interesting. Okay. So anyways, I think we're gonna end this one. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see if I had another one, but I think this is it for this video. And maybe this is the end. So yeah, there's nice little bike lanes everywhere in Hengqin as well. You can see the ICC through that, through there. And I just want to capture that because it's Macau Hengqin. And then it has like um, some Macau references in here. I think Sao Paulo, uh, I think that's saying maybe Sao Domingos maybe. Uh, Portugal chicken and then it's like Macau Hengqin craft mark. So anyways, we're on a little bike lane and we're going to end it right there. Hey, check it out Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Yeah. Yeah.